I'm Glenn Tomlinson, and I'm the Chief Officer of Learning and Community Engagement at the Norton Museum of Art. Tonight, we've uh, celebrated aspects of our Chinese collection and a new installation of Chinese paintings by women artists of the 20th century. We decided to invite Ying Zhou, who is a teaching artist, uh, a wonderfully trained uh, Chinese painter, but also a teacher at the Armory Art Center with whom we're, we partner. Uh, she's joined us tonight to share her skills and talent and talk to our guests about uh, the ancient tradition of Chinese painting. We're also really excited to have the Scott Marishan Quartet here tonight. Uh, they're performing uh, jazz fusion. Scott is actually a harpist, but he's been able to marry uh, that very ancient musical instrument to modern jazz. Started music like really, really young, but um, playing the harp, probably I was 30, so I'll give you my age, like 35 years now I've been playing the harp, yeah. It's a great instrument. There's people playing jazz on it now, and, and, um, and it's difficult to play jazz on it, you know. This instrument is probably 15 years old. This instrument goes for about 27,000. They're expensive. We have never actually played together as a quartet. So tonight we're just gonna do it. But that's the whole essence of what jazz is about. It's a vocabulary, everybody kind of understands it. So I sent them a whole bunch of music in an email and uh, we're gonna show up and we're gonna play and have a good time, you know? And yeah, just like basically standard jazz tunes that people play, um, it's kind of like, part of the vocabulary that you need to have to, you know, to know. But that's exactly what jazz is. I mean, like I'm talking to you, I'm not thinking like, oh, I'm gonna use a verb, I'm gonna use a pronoun, and now, you know, I'm, we're just talking. And this, that's the same thing with really, really good jazz musicians. We listen to one another and we play. And you know, sometimes it's great, and sometimes you crash and burn. Yeah. You know, <laughs> and that's okay too. You know? With Art After Dark, we always try and have a variety of offerings. So the painting demonstration that we have behind me, um, a lecture by our curators or guest speakers, um, great entertainers from around South Florida and sometimes beyond, and wonderful galleries, a collection, and marvelous exhibitions all throughout the year. It's been a great night at the Norton.